Hey guys, Golfer Man here, and today we're going to do an In the Bag 2013. This is my first upload for YouTube, and I'm just going to show you my clubs. So we'll start with the driver, or actually we'll start with the tour sticks. I have a pair of tour sticks, alignment sticks, right here, orange and blue. I'm an Auburn fan, that's why. Uh, I have a orange and black Titleist golf bag, and a little bit of white trim. Anyways, we'll go to the driver, which is a Cobra Amp. So you can see it has a really nice head cover. And uh, take the head cover off. Sorry. <coughs> take that off. Okay. Uh, here's the head, as you can see. Right here. It's the Cobra Amp. It's the uh, higher end one where you can get the uh, selectability down here for a closed face, open face, or neutral face. I have mine on closed right now. It's ten and a half speed tuned. Um, didn't mean to do that, but oh well. It's a rest in peace uh, Adilla shaft. It is 50 grams regular stiffness. Orange Cobra stock grip, and it is a Lampkin, if it will focus. Yes, yeah, you can see Lampkin, and that's what it looks like at a dress. Very nice. I like this club, it's very lightweight and a good club to use off deck. Second club, I did my tailor made 2.0 burner rescue, or not, yeah, I guess, whatever you want to call it, hybrid. It's equivalent to a three iron. If I can get this head off. Okay. This is what it looks like. I haven't had this club in about a year. Maybe not that no, not that long, but you know, the only bad thing you can see it's wear and tear on it, and it's not even that old. The f back of it looks fine. Just the bottom gets so worn up easily. Easy scuff marks as you can tell. But this club is very smooth. Uh, it's still worth it. And the shaft is a React 60 gram regular shaft. Stock burner, burner 2.0 grips that they give you. I really like it. It's nice and squishy. It has a good feel to it. That's what it looks like at a dress. Very nice club. Um, We'll go to the woods. I guess we'll do both of them. I don't really use my woods that much anymore. I kind of use just the, um, that, uh, tailor made, but I have an Auburn Tigers cover. Take that off. It's an R7 standard old club. It's getting a little short. I'm probably going to give this thing away, sell it at Edwin Watts or whatever. It has a React shaft. You probably remember the old red, yellow, and black ones. It's upside down, but. Uh, regular flex, react, 70 gram, whatever you want to call it. And I have a lamp, or I have it, the regular stock golf pride grip on that. So it looks like in dress. This is, that was my three wood, by the way, if I didn't say that. Here's my five wood. It's a Ping I25. This is an old club. It's real wood. You may be making fun of me right now, but this thing is the smoothest club ever. It runs with the ping, oh, what does it say? Let's see if I can get it focused for you. Ping 77 light, lampkin, uh, medium, coiled uh, grip. Looks at like that stance, it's super smooth. Uh, wooded clubs are very nice, actually. Uh, my irons, let's pull out my pitching wedge. I have these custom fit R11 irons, they're super smooth. I like them a lot. The top line. It's not too chunky. It's a pretty thin top line. Has a little bit of the muscle back for forgiveness. It's between, I would say it's between a blade and a full cavity back. Stock uh, Golf Pride grip on it. Or tailor made grip, I mean. KBS tour shaft. Uh, 90 grams. I uh, really like those irons. I have them through a five to pitching wedge. Custom done for me. 
Um, next club is the Titleist Vokey, 54 degree, 14 degrees of bounce spin milled with the oil can design. It's kind of worn up a little bit. Got it last year. It has the standard uh, Vokey, uh, Bob Vokey shaft, standard Titleist shaft. Looks like this, and address. Sorry, my clubs are a little bit dirty. I went out to the range a few days ago. Hit. Um, also, my 56 degree CG12 zip grooves. Uh, the bounce is 14. Uh, this thing is pretty old. Had it for a long time. Really like it still. Um, I'm really not sure what the shaft is on this one, but it's a uh, blue DD2 Golf Pride grip. I really like these grips. And yeah, that's for that wedge into the last club in my bag. And then we'll do my in the actual bag is the Ghost Sailor Made Corza. Really like this putter. I got it the end of the last year's golf season. Ghost Corza Taylor Made. Got it on sale. Here's the face of it. So it looks like it address has a nice squishy um tailor made golf pride grip. I really like it. It is a thirty five inch for me. I really like this club. Very good club. I'll just throw that back in there. And then I'll do my actual in the bag part, so I use a foot joy glove with a little pin marker on it. In here, I just carry my tees, you know, a little bit of cash if I need it on the range or whatever. Um, my trail cards, that kind of stuff. Ball markers, that kind of thing. I have a Robert Trent Jones golf towel. Has all the Robert Trent Jones in Alabama on here. A Sharpie. How many strokes you have a sh stroke counter. The Regent Stroll Shoal Creek Tradition Badge, a club, unlike Groover, whatever you want to say. Nothing I keep in here. I usually keep a um, or I keep this in here for good luck. Little cross. Um, I usually have a rule book in there or in here. Here's my weather gear. At uh, here's my uh, rules of golf book. <laughs> There's still a Gatorade in there from like a year ago. <laughs> Um, I keep my balls in here. I play Bridgestone E6s. Sometimes the Bridgestone, uh, yeah, or same thing. It's just an orange. And I'll play Titleist sometimes. Pro V1s. I use those in Pro V1s. This really feels like what kind of, how I'm hitting the ball. This really depends how I do it. If I feel like I'm getting, hitting it real well and down into the ball, I'll use the Vokies. Or not the Vokies, the, um... Pro V ones. If I feel like I'm hooking it or drawing it, I'll use the E sixes. But anyways, have a little drink cooler in here. Usually in here I have like tape, medical stuff, or not really medical. Oh well, yeah, tape. So just to cut the stuff off because I can never get it off myself for some reason. Um, driver thing changer that changes the from neutral. Tees. And yeah, that's it. But thanks for watching, guys. This is my In the Bag 2013. I'll be posting a um, course vlog this weekend. And thanks for watching.